South Korea launches a manhunt for the founder of a cryptocurrency stablecoin. After the collapse of $40 billion Terra ecosystem and its algorithm stablecoin at UST, which is the first domino to fall in this year's crypto winter, the South Korean court issued an arrest warrant against Do Kwon. He's the co-founder of this now defunct stablecoin issuer Terraform Labs, according to Financial Crimes Unit of the Supreme Prosecutor's Office of South Korea. The warrant included five additional persons, according to Bloomberg News. But this is not the only time that uh, he's done something like this. In July, South Korean prosecutors raided the home of Terraform Labs co-founder Daniel Shin, he was uh, part of a probe into allegations of illegal activity behind Terra's collapse. And as a reminder, this is not the first time Do Kwan uh, was, uh, has done something like this. He also was behind another failed algorithmic stablecoin called Basis Cash, which launched on Ethereum 2020. In his first interview last month, Kwan maintained that he is cooperating with authorities and despite the widespread investigation of Terra Collapse, Kwan denied allegations that the project was a fraud. In an interview with crypto media startup Coinage that floated the prospect of jail time, Kwan said life is long, but a life sentence is longer. And this is on Zero Hedge by Tyler Durden. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support. Kindly support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support, and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.